Hey guys, what are you doing? Uh, we have an update regarding FunKS. As I promised, I was playing with it a little bit and um, it's an awesome little game device. Unfortunately, there, there was a one little thing that was driving me absolutely bonkers. Oh, volume. I don't know if you can hear it, but um, whenever there was uh, something going on on the screen. There was a high pitch sound coming out of the speaker and it's barely audible, but it's like that frequency that's annoying. Um, but anyway, um, a funky project came out with the new firmware that actually solves that issue. So actually we're gonna go through the process of upgrading the firmware on this device. So that's why we're here. I'm gonna leave all the links in the description, but pretty much they explain everything how it works. So um, I already downloaded the file, it's right here. Um, and what we need to do is hook up the cable and then plug in uh, the device to the computer. And then once it's plugged in, we are supposed to hit the menu button and then we are going to mount a USB. At this point, our device is connected as a USB device to our computer. And what we can do is grab that file that we just downloaded and um, copy its content to the root. And at this project, we just eject USB and um, the device will reboot and perform upgrade. So let's see if it's gonna work that way. So I'm just gonna open a file location, copy that fold, uh, file, and then drop it to the root of this device. It's gonna take just a couple of seconds to transfer uh, the size of the file is like 83 megabytes. We'll see how long that takes to uh, to transfer. These are not uh, not crazy speeds, but I mean, it's, it's fine, I guess. Um, just a couple more seconds. Okay, the firmware is transferred to the new device, to the FunKS, and at this point, we're gonna eject USB. We're gonna confirm yes. And it's updating, awesome. So let's see how long that takes. Okay, so they have this uh, screwdriver and wrench icon on the screen. So that probably means that it's updating. Okay. Oh, okay, it's already um, telling us what it's doing. It's extracting, extracting firmware update. Do not turn off the console, we definitely won't do that. <laughs> Worst thing you can do is just stop something in the middle of the update. We've seen that with our Windows computers. So let's see how long this takes. In the meantime, while this is doing... Oh, okay. Wow. Restarting. That was fast all right that was amazing that was super fast let's see zero high pitch sound they actually fixed it awesome all right okay let's start my favorite game and before i do that i'm just gonna take the volume take the volume down so i don't get the copyright strike Okay. All right, let's play some Crash Bandicoot. Oh, I can even resume. Awesome. Anyway, 
Uh, this totally worked, it was super easy to do. Uh, they have comprehensive instruction on their uh, docu page and it's awesome. I mean, I like the fact that these guys are just pushing on their project after they successfully did their Kickstarter campaign. Uh, that's what I expect for these from these kind of projects that, you know, they keep perfecting their product. They just don't, you know, make a product, take the money and run away or even worse, just um, take the money, run away and never deliver the product. I've seen those, but these guys are awesome. They're totally legit and I really like the product and I hope they're going to come up with something new um, pretty soon. Um, just want to keep supporting these guys anyway guys um i hope you enjoyed watching this video i hope you find it um um valuable uh if you did just click the click the like button if you didn't just wait for the next one and um i'll get you something else anyway thanks for watching see you next time have a good one bye bye